I'm Linda Holland. I'm a research biologist in the Marine Biology Research Division of Scripps Institution of Oceanography, which is part of the University of California, San Diego. People often ask me, what is Amphioxus and why is it interesting to study? Um, Amphioxus is a small marine animal that lives burrowed in the sand. It looks like a little fish, but it has no paired eyes, no ears, um, no limbs, no, just a little bit of a fin. Uh, as someone said to me once, gee, these don't look like much. Uh, but it's important because it's on a, the direct line to the vertebrates. And so it's the very key phylogenetic organism. And it occupies this place right at the base of the lineage leading to the vertebrates. Now the vertebrate and Amphioxus lineages split about 520 million years ago during the Cambrian. And there are fossils in the soft mudstone of China of very early, clearly vertebrates that look very much like a modern Amphioxus. There are also some fossils of a little questionable, but maybe fossil Amphioxus. So this little organism has not changed very much since the Cambrian, and it's this slow evolution and its relationship to the vertebrates that makes it very important for understanding how humans, how we came from our invertebrate ancestors. And so the Amphioxus genome sequence was done by the Amphioxus community of about 30 laboratories worldwide. And the key take home message from this genome sequence is that the Amphioxus and human genomes are very much alike. <laughs>